Yeah, it's raw and it has its own enzymes. It's also enzyme enhanced because it's, you set up an environment where the lactic acid um, microorganisms can be done. They pre-digest your food. This is an external stomach. Right, think of it that way. You have the same lactic acid, those are stomach acids. You have the same bacteria in your intestinal tract that would be invoked into this jar. So you're essentially pre-digesting the food, which actually opens up the cellulose, right? Uh, plant chemistry is uh, it held within cells, right? When you get the lactic acid to start breaking this open, the cells open so that when you chew, this is what chewing does, right? That lost art of chewing the food. Um, that would break open cellulose. Now, if you ferment it first, it's way more efficient than the watch TV and the chew three times and swallow it, um, or even consciously chew it. So then we chew 40 to 70 times a bite. 30? Do I hear 31? <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, very important reminder for us all right, um, to really chew the food because we're actually activating the enzymatic response as well as we're starting our digestive capacity, which begins when you see the food, right? Not when you sit down at the restaurant and hand it. Half the digestive process has, has not occurred that way. Um, so you make a salt brine, and that salt brine makes it a, a neutral medium where only really what's called probiotics can enter. Essentially what probiotics are are last, uh, lactobacillus and acidophilus. Those are strains, those are genus of bacteria, which there are multiplicities of. The problem with some of these sterile culture ideas still being part of our uh, environment is that we're not getting that homeopathic exposure, um, as I was mentioning, to boost the immune system. So if you get sterile probiotics that were made in a laboratory that get put in your yogurt, it will not come close to fermenting your own vegetables in your own house with your own viruses, your own bacteria, your own molds, your own, own yeasts. And this kind of transforms that to be homeopathically available to your body because it turns out that in your digestive tract, bacteria are digesting your food, not you.